Palmyrene funerary relief busts first appeared in the middle of the first century CE. Carved from square pieces of limestone, these decorative slabs acted as closures to burial niches inside underground tombs. While the names and lineage of the deceased were engraved in Aramaic above the shoulders of the figures, it is believed that the busts were created as idealized decorations rather than as the actual likeness of the person they honored. Some features of the reliefs represent status, wealth, or family roles. Caravan traders, for example, are depicted with a sword or a whip. Priests can be identified by their cylindrical caps. Figures holding a scroll or a leaf are the most common and tell very little about the life of the person they represent. Some stylistic changes occurred over time. According to Dr. Harold Ingold's 1928 classifications, Palmyrene funerary reliefs can be divided into three chronological groupings. Group 1, from 50 to 150 CE, represents a more stylized period of Palmyrene artwork. Eyes were wide open with two concentric circles for pupils. Males were portrayed as beardless, and females were carved wearing little to no jewelry. Often they were depicted holding an object, such as a spindle, to represent domesticity. Group 2, from 150 CE to 200 CE, saw some Roman influence under the rule of Emperor Hadrian. Male busts began to feature beards. Hair became thicker and longer, and eyes and skin became more realistic in their depictions. Backgrounds appeared in the carvings, often featuring camels and horses in the desert. Female figures wore more jewelry, and symbols of domesticity became less common, likely related to the rise of wealth during this period. Busts from Group 3, from 200 to 273 CE, were more realistic in appearance. Folds in fabric were carved more smoothly than past representations, and beards continued to be shown on men now raised slightly from the face. Female figures were no longer shown with domestic objects, instead using their hands to hold their veils. Palmyrene funerary reliefs ceased to be made after 273 CE due to the city's destruction by the Romans, marking the end of Palmyra as a civilization.